Oh, for the tranquility of the open highway. Time to reflect over a nice cup of tea. Brewing up for two. That's the English way of filling in time. Get the stove out, boil the water, add some milk and dig out the biscuits. And think about the crazy way governments run the nation's roads. In Britain, roads are valued at £87 billion. Motorists pay for them through an annual road fund tax. No account is taken of how much use a motorist makes of the highways. People who don't drive much, who use highways in the countryside, subsidise the urban motorists who clog up the busy roads. Time for a stretch, take a dog for a walk. Road pricing? Now that's a good idea. Charge people for what they use and get rid of the taxes that damage the economy. Taxes that encourage people who behave in ways that damage the environment. Road pricing? It's paying a rent for what you use. Fair for everyone. Higher rental charges for those driving at peak times, causing congestion and shoving the costs of pollution and wasted time on other people. Makes sense, doesn't it? Roadside reflection. What are the chances of politicians listening? They jet set around in their cavalcades with police escorts. No time wasted on congested roads for them. Better have another cup of tea. Think about all the efficiencies for the economy. If we could get rid of those bad taxes on our wages, the taxes that penalize people who go to work for their living. Makes sense all round, doesn't it? Smooth out the traffic flows, reduce pollution, faster journey times, increase the productivity of the economy. What are we waiting for? Road rents, not road rage. That's the idea.